Hey, it's Mike Whitfield with Workout Finishers, and this finisher is for Travis Stetzel and, of course, all of his hardcore readers. And this is actually from the dungeon section inside the Ad Finishers 2.0 manual. So what you're going to do is you're going to do this circuit as many times as possible in six minutes. So as soon as that six minutes is up, boom, you're done. And, of course, you're going to stop right then and there wherever you are in the circuit. Now, here's a couple of twists to it. Each exercise is to be done for six reps. Very simple to remember, all right? This is why it's called the 6-6. Six, six. So each exercise is done for six reps, and of course you're going to go through the circuit as many times as possible in six minutes. And on top of that, what I want you to do is I want you to do each exercise with as fast of a tempo as possible, but under control. All right, so now I'm going to walk you through it. So you're going to start off with a dumbbell front squat. So by putting that load in front of you, your abs are gonna to have to work harder to stabilize themselves. And that's what we're wanting to do. We want to hit those abs while at the same time improve our conditioning. So feet are just outside, shoulder width apart. You're gonna take those dumbbells, put them right there at shoulder height, okay? Or you could do a kettlebell goblet squat, that's fine too. And you're gonna dip down and then back up. Dip down and back up. You're gonna do six reps of those, okay? Then we're gonna go into the double burpee. Now my version of a double burpee is when you go down, kick your legs out, and then do two push-ups, and, and then jump back up. Now, if you want to take it to the next level, you can certainly do two jump squats. So it'll look like this. One, two, in, jump up, jump up, and that counts as one rep, all right? So you're gonna do six reps of those. Then you're gonna go into the Spider-Man climb. Again, we're gonna hit those abs really hard, so you're gonna assume the push-up position, okay? hips are low, you're going to take that foot, put it on the outside of the same side, outside of the hand, and then back, out, and then back. You're going to do six reps per side on those. And then we're going to continue with the conditioning. So we're going to end the circuit with the lunge jump. So split squat stance, dip down, switch. All right. So you're gonna do six reps per side on those. Now here's the very challenging part. Remember the first part of the circuit is that, uh, that dumbbell front squat. So you're gonna to have to go from the lunge jumps into the front squat, which is gonna be very taxing, very challenging. As you can see, I'm out of breath just explaining it, but that's why it's in the dungeon section. So give that finisher a shot, have fun with it, tag it in at the end of one of Travis's awesome workouts. That'll take your conditioning to the next level while at the same time, making your core a lot stronger. All right, talk to you next time.